Hello, and welcome back to another SRPG Studio tutorial. I'm Jay the Duelist, and today I'll be showing you how to uh, export your finished up uh, game project uh, to uh, so that you can release it to, uh, for other people to play. Sorry, uh, trial use version users. This this is a, a full version only tutorial because. The option to export is uh, locked to uh, uh, to paid version only. But now, that you, uh, say you finished your game here. You, this is not the prettiest game. It's not even a game at all, really. But nah, I'm just using it for a demonstration. <laughs> now, once you've you know confirmed your finished product and everything, you go down to uh, release a uh, file, release project, and. Uh, when it says archives, you probably want to check everything as well as encrypt just to keep your aim safe. Now you want to pick uh, where you're going to save your game. You hit OK, and once it's done releasing, it should appear in your folder. I'm sure, you could run your uh, uh, zip up your project with WinZip or whatever, and uh, or 7-Zip or whatever you use, uh, and put it out like this. But that's not the best thing to do. For starters, the game does not generate you a save folder to, uh, for your players to put other save files in which if they try to save their progress the game will crash so in order to fix that we go down to new folder save the capital S I don't know if that's important or not but let's just I'll leave it at that and let's test it from there yep see save if you didn't have that folder uh, the, the game would not be able to save its progress. We'll just go ahead and delete that save file now because we don't need it. Now, we, you can also change the control scheme for your players if you go to Game Any and open that in a notepad editor. Or a text editor, really. And you can scroll down to where it says Keyboard and say, like, you don't want to escape to do anything and you don't want any button to correspond to closing the entire game. You can just go down here where it says exit equals escape and just delete that line. And that's all it really is to it. And if you want to say like like uh, to open the menu you want to use uh, the B button you uh, just go down here where it says system, press B and save and you're good to go. Now that you've covered both of those uh, the things now you can zip it up and save uh, the game to your uh, to a zip folder and put and host it wherever you feel like it, so you can put the game out to those who want to play it. I know this was an extremely short tutorial compared to the rest of the ones I've done before, but uh, yeah, there's not really much else you, ha you really have to do once you're at, at this point. So I. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial, okay? Goodbye.